Now we're filming. Sit on. My lips are tingling. Welcome back to my channel. My name is Christina. This is my sister Jessica. How are you guys doing? Okay, so today we are filming a $400 Alta haul. This is my first haul I've ever filmed on my channel and if you are new to my channel, go ahead and hit the subscribe button below and we'll get right into the video. Rolling! Roll it! I think the thing about Alta is like you just go in and everything looks good to you like yeah the displays are just so perfect so then you're like oh, i need that and then it said that there's like this is for three dollars so you're like oh my gosh i need that and then it's just like downhill from there and this was actually my first time at alta i've never shot at alta before really? yeah no i haven't so i was like went in there and i was like this is so much better than sephora just because like i feel like when i walk into sephora everyone's just kind of like you're right and then alta everyone was so nice and I don't know. Yeah, you could ask him anything. Comment down below if you agree with me that you think everyone at Alta is nicer than people at Sephora. Just personal opinion. If you love Sephora, don't hate me. So then, first thing that we did when we got in there was check the clearance section. Yeah. Because Alta <sighs> clearance is pretty good. It just has a lot of hair care, which if you're into hair care, then you're going to really like that. Um... But I'm honestly, mostly into make I mean, you guys see my hair. It like literally looks so bad, but it's fine. But honestly, we went over there because Larley just did a clearance Ulta shopping situation. So, so I was like, oh my gosh, we have to yeah, go there because we're Laura Lee, So that's why we did that. We are Laura Lee's. Ooh, ooh, ooh. I found this human in kind all skin types like body wash. It was originally ten dollars and I got it for two fifty, so I kind of couldn't pass it up oh. because I needed a body wash. So so okay, we'll see. We'll see how it goes. But it's like all natural. None of these additional things. I don't know what says it all on here, but it also has like a different language on the back. I don't know if you can see that. So usually things in a different language are good. I don't know. Tony Moly like face masks were on sale, so I picked up three of them. Um, one is the rice mask. It's for clearing skin. Oh, so nice. The next is this pork hair red wine one. Oh, so fancy. And then the next is this three stepper like nose strip situation. So I thought that that was great because you know, you don't want the blackheads <laughs> on the nose. <laughs> Gotta get rid of them, take care of yourself. Okay, so the first thing I got was a dry conditioner by the brand Pureology. I don't know if you can see that, but that's what it looks like. <laughs> yeah, so this is supposed to go on to your mid to um, ends of your hair to give it an extra shine. I tried doing it in the car, but, but really the windy. thing in the car is I had the window down, so like it was like going right out the window and like into my face. And like so into my mouth because she was, I was right. driving. Okay, also in the clearance section, I found this Light Night Cream by Neutrogena right here it was originally 12.99 and i got it for 6.50 so okay. this is like a little night serum cream situation hyperallergenic fragrance free alcohol free and it says to apply apply nightly all over face and neck so we'll see hopefully that will give me a little you know moisturizing situa this is the neutrogen <laughs> the neutrogena stubborn acne daily leave-on mask and I heard that this is really good and it was like eight dollars and I got it for five so I'm just gonna try it out like why not I'm just trying to have good skin you know so I'm going to try it out and I'm excited about it and it was cheap so yeah okay to be honest I watched Soella God, I love her and she got all she went to Ulta for the first time and she got all this totally moly stuff and it was so cute so I got this um space kitten exfoliating galactic black peel off mask Ooh. i thought it was really interesting and like the box is like super cute and we'll see i mean peel off i'm all about it that looks nice see it space kitten i love masks same i do care space kitten hopefully it smells good oh, see. oh it's sealed. i can open it can i it's so hot in my room right now because today's like the nicest day it's been in a while so it's so hot and I'm dying, and I have the window open, and I'm dying. Maybe I won't be able to open this. 
Okay, it's my turn. So I got the NYX lingerie in the color sensual, I want to say it Ooh. is. Ooh, Ooh sensual. sensual. No basics allowed. <laughs> this is the Maybelline New York um, Master Camo. I got two different shades. I got the apricot and then the green. So this is for like, this is for dark circles and then for redness. So for oh, any yeah, discolor discoloration I, I have on my face, which I have a lot of, I feel like these will help. And I have heard really good things about these ones specifically. So I'm curious to see if they actually work. Okay, so the next thing I got was the Tarte Shape Tape. And I know that's like so basic to get, but I heard that it was really good. So I decided to grab it. No basic slow. And I got it in the shade uh, Fair Neutral. And yeah, I just tried it like a little bit before this video. And I don't see what the hype is. Maybe I just need to try it some more, but... I'm going to try it again. I that it's really drying. So. Yeah, I'm going to try it again, and we'll see how I like it later on. Okay. So I also went to get the same shape tape because I wanted one too, and I literally grabbed the one right behind Christina's, and apparently I didn't grab the shape tape. I grabbed the clay stick foundation. <laughs> The foundation but i honestly really like it i have it under my eyes today and i was just like maybe i will keep it because it's beautiful and it's the right shade i'm not too mad at myself but at the same time it's not what i wanted but it's okay it's fine it's, it's, fine. it's fine we're fine we're fine so recently i've been using the covergirl simply ageless with a lay foundation and I've been going tanning recently as well, so I, it's just getting too light for my skin. Also, it's not, it's a kind of like a medium coverage, and I'm more of a full coverage kind of girl. So I like to add in the L'Oreal Paris Paris Infallible Pro Matte, and this is in the shade 103, so I just mix a little bit of this in, and it makes it a little more full coverage and mattifying, so I like this, and I've, al I've always loved this foundation, so I picked this up as well. Yeah, and then I also got um, the same shade, well, 203, but in the Pro Glow, because I always wear matte foundation, and I'm trying to steer clear of that. Just because my skin is so dry right now, and that's even more drying. So I'm trying to do glowy, glowy foundation. Mm -hmm. And so I'm trying to find my best and my fave of the glowy foundation. So I'm just going to use this because this it's drugstore and it's cheap. So if I don't like it, then it's not like I'm wasting a ton of money. Right, right, right. I... She splurged. Splurged. She splurges a lot. <laughs> to be honest, yeah, you're right. So... I've never owned an Anastasia Beverly Hills, like, palette before, but, uh, like, she has one, and, like, so many of my friends have them, and they just always rave about them, and I wasn't even looking for a palette, like, not even at all, and I walked up to this and was like, this is everything. Everything! Like, it's so pretty. I touched these shades. Pure butter. Like, can you even see this? Like, those swatches, like, stop. Oh, they Ooh. are so pretty. Ooh. Like, right there. These are just, like, insane. So, I'm really excited about this. But I'm really excited. Ooh. A little bit of fallout. Could you but, like, see it? I don't know if you guys see wow. this right now. That's the color bronze. That's oh, the my gosh. Like, yeah, that's really pretty. That's, oh, sorry. That's that color right there. Stunning. <laughs> Stunning. Stunning. I'm so excited. It's so good. Um, I also got this, just like Ulta Beauty, five little super blenders, absorbent That's nice. sponges. I needed new um, sponges, and I just thought that this was nice. And I, this, I think this was $10, so great deal for all five of these little brushes, or brushes, sponges. So... There it is, ink signing. Ooh, yay. Da 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 so I got just an Ulta black gel liner and it was two dollars. 
out of 10, well it was supposed to be 10 but I got it for two so Ooh. I just saw that in the clearance section so I picked it up I never really used gel liner but you know I decided a lot of people love it it's like yeah, their go-to I decided to take it for a spin so take it excited for a spin. about mm -hmm. that piece this is the um what's it even called Mario Badescu Mario Badescu Rose Facial Spray. Rose Facial Spray. Rose Water is like a huge, like, ev I swear everything has rose water in it now. Like, yeah, the whole Pixie huge line, they're skin huge. skincare thing right now. It's huge, so. Gotta stay on top of We're the on trends. that skincare, like, trip right now. So on the hopefully, grind. Hopefully, we'll come across, you know, the right thing. <laughs> My skin better be popping. I hope so, because, like, we just did the Susan Barstow. <laughs> in um what's it bridesmaids when they're like lillian ew you don't need a story behind everything i'm probably gonna cut, cut, cut most of it out so then we came like they were also having their you know they're having their like big sale so their hemp mini lotions were two for ten so i picked up one for christina and i oh so they're really cute 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 and they are originally seven fifty each, so we got them for you know five each since it was two for ten. So that was exciting. Moisturize those hands, girls. You know when you get to the the line and you see all those like mini things, like you can't. I am so bad because they always get me, always always these cute little miniature things and you're like yes and they're so I want cute that. they're so cute they're way cheaper and you're like yeah i've been wanting to try that like for example the minis the are the way to go Hula benefit like i've been wanting to try this for forever so i was like you know what i'll get it it's cute it's tiny and then next to it they had the the california like blush so i was like i need both of these because they're so freaking dang cute and everybody talks about <laughs> so freaking dang cute freaking dang cute <laughs> so i got both of those and then i also picked up a smashbox uh, photo finish pore minimizing primer because I just ran out of the one that I had so I needed another one anyways okay so I got and this is like a purchase that I didn't really want to buy just because it's expensive for what it is but I ended up getting it because every time I go into Sephora I look at it and I always want it so I, it was the Too Faced Extreme Lip Injections so I'm excited about this because I'm trying to have like big lips without, you know, getting <laughs> lip injections. I'm scared. It tingles. Already? Mm-mm. Maybe it does have to be oh you just messed up that applicator. Oh. Okay, so I'm excited about that. Mm-mm. -mm. Trying to have big lips. Ooh. Do they look big already? Maybe. <laughs> I'm waiting for it to tingle. It'll start tingling soon. Is it, it supposed to? Yeah. And then that's how you know. Maybe if you put it on. Because isn't, correct me if I'm wrong, but isn't lip plumber like it gives your lips an allergic reaction? That's why they get so big. My friend Taylor told me that. So if it's true, let me know. Leave a comment down below if that's true. Or if you know how it works, because I'm interested as well. Thanks. Okay, so also in the checkout line, I picked up this little Tory Burch um, roller ball. Let's see, it looks like this. It's so cute. It's so cute. Ooh, du perfume. And du perfume. And du perfume. perfume. <laughs> I, don't I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. Oh, they're tingling. I don't know, but it smells really good. It doesn't tell me what, like, the. It smells really good. I don't, it doesn't tell me like what the notes are or anything, but I put it on my wrist to smell. It smells good. Oh, it does good. smell good. It smells good. I'm excited. We'll just put a little up there and there. Oh, I'm going to smell good. And then also in that section, I picked up the Ulta Beauty um, little blotting pads set here. The last thing I got was um, Not Your Mother's Dry Shampoo. So yeah, it was only $4, so I decided, you know what, let's just do it, because everyone needs dry shampoo, and I've been using a really crappy shampoo and conditioner. It's head and shoulders, and I really don't like it. I she love loves it. head and shoulders. I don't it's like it, because I can't get it, I don't, 
I can't get it out of my hair all the way. I think it's and just because it her hair is so, like, she has so much more hair than me that it must take her, it just gets, like, stuck in there. It's either that or it's the claws. Because the claws, you know, if you have claws and you're trying to wash your hair, it's really it hard. Short. Mine are so long. I like them long. So, that's the problem. So, we're just gonna, I don't even know if it's gonna make it worse or better, but we're just gonna do it. On to my last product. Um, when I was at the checkout, they, she told me that I had nine dollars like off or points. free from my points, and she was like, "You can if there's anything that you want that's nine bucks, like go grab it now because it's free." And I was like, "Okay, so sweet." And I so said, then she, "I was like, she doesn't need anything else," and she's like, "Get it's it's free. She's got to go get it." And I was like, "I know." Okay. I was like, "I really don't know." Okay, go do it. So then she showed me to the, like the sleek makeup which i've always been interested in but it's this like conditioning mascara can you even see it? conditioning mascara so i'm i've never had a conditioning mascara before but i'm curious to see how this like works with my total temptations mascara use this as a coat first and then put that on we'll see i don't know it was free so okay guys so if you guys have any comments on any of the makeup if you like it if you hate it Leave a comment down below and let me know because I want to know your guys' thoughts. Also, comment down below any videos that you want me to do next. If you liked my sister, go ahead and follow her on all of her social medias. I'll leave them linked down below. And I love you so much. She loves you so much. I and, love you so much. And we will see you guys next time. Bye! Bye.